How many fruits and vegetables should you really be eating per day? Fruits and vegetables are incredibly good for us. We all know this. And governments tell us that we should aim to be eating somewhere between five and seven individual fruits and vegetables per day. Then we see a lot of products and packaging that promise us they count toward our five a day. So what's the deal? Does your ready meal really count? And just how much fruit should you actually be getting? Listen up and let me explain. The first thing to recognize is that the government recommendation of five or seven fruit or vegetables per day, depending on where you live, is just arbitrary. In other words, it isn't based on anything. That's not to say it's not good advice. It certainly is good advice. But five and seven are not magic numbers. Why not six? And ideally, you should be aiming to get as much fruit and vegetables as possible without consuming too much sugar or calories in the process. In fact, many health organizations and officials actually recommend that we aim to get nine fruits and vegetables. They simply released the lower recommendations as they felt that was a more realistic target for most people to aim for. The thing to understand is that fruits and vegetables are not magic foods. They aren't instantly healthy simply as a result of their categorization. Rather, fruits and vegetables are considered healthy because they contain certain vitamins and minerals, along with essential fatty acids and amino acids. Our bodies need these to perform a myriad of different crucial tasks in maintaining our health and enabling normal bodily functions. The objective of eating lots of fruits and vegetables, then, is to get as many of these things as we can, and thereby to enjoy the best possible health. So is five or seven a magic number? No, because the precise range of minerals and vitamins you get in your diet can vary drastically depending on which five or seven fruits you get. And more importantly, when you consume something like a ready-made lasagna that claims to be one of your five a day, it likely isn't as good as if you ate the real thing, a tomato. Why? Apart from being covered in added sugar and salt, it will also have been highly processed to the point that at least some of the nutritional value will be lost, even if that's just the fiber. So the new rule, just eat lots. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.